Hello everyone, in this video we're gonna talk about how to find the circumcenter of a triangle on a coordinate plane. Okay, so a couple things we need to know about the circumcenter. We need to know that circumcenter is found by using the perpendicular bisectors of the triangle. So perpendicular bisector does two things, right? It's perpendicular to the side of the triangle and it bisects the side, which means it cuts through the midpoint of the side. Um, so in this case, the one we're looking at right here is a right triangle. And so because of that, we have a vertical leg, we have a horizontal leg. And so the perpendicular bisectors will be fairly easy to find for those two sides of the triangle. And the circumcenter is where all three perpendicular bisectors intersect. So another characteristic of the circumcenter is um, if, it is an, if we have an acute triangle, the circumcenter is on the inside of the triangle. If we have a right triangle, the circumcenter is on the hypotenuse of the right triangle. And if we have an obtuse triangle, then the circumcenter is on the outside of the triangle. Okay, so here we have a right triangle. So we know the circumcenter is gonna be somewhere along the hypotenuse of our triangle, okay? So let's take a look at our horizontal side length here, right? It's this side right here, AB. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight units. And um, so since it's eight units, we know the midpoint would be four units along there, right? So one, two, three, four. So our midpoint would be right there. And we know since that is a horizontal segment, its perpendicular segment would be a vertical line, right? So I can draw a vertical line right through there. And that would be my perpendicular bisector for side AB. Now we can look at side BC and the length here is one, two, three, four, five, and six. So since the length of BC is six, we know that the midpoint would be one, two, and three. And so now since that BC is a vertical line, we can draw a horizontal line as its perpendicular bisector. And now look where we have located out our intersection, right? So now we have found our circumcenter and our circumcenter is located at two comma one, okay? And so that is how you find the circumcenter of a triangle on a coordinate plane.